Hello everyone. In today's video, we will be learning about motions of the Earth. So let's see rotation and revolution. The Earth spins on its axis once in twenty-four hours is called rotation. The Earth moves around the Sun on its orbit once in three sixty-five days is called revolution. Right now. Rotation is getting over in twenty-four hours, which is making one day, and revolution is getting over in three sixty-five days, which is called a year. Right. So rotation is daily motion, and revolution is annual motion. Now, Earth's axis. Earth's axis is an imaginary line. You can see here, which on which the Earth rotates counterclockwise. the north northern end is known as north pole and the southern end is known as south pole it is tilted at the angle of 23.5 with the vertical line and with the orbit it is making remaining that is 66 and 5 degree angle now the as the earth is tilted at 23.5 degree angle this angle is known as inclination of earth's axis inclination inclination means tilted now what are the effects of earth's tilted axis number 1 as earth's axis is tilted it causes varying length of days and nights means the days and nights all over the world are not of equal length right just at equator they are equal of equal length as we move away to the north and south it keeps on decreasing and increasing let's see here the line shows that on the equator the length of day and night is equal right but as we move to the north the length of day and length of night will change here you see the length of day is longer compared to length of night i'm talking about northern hemisphere similarly over here the length of day is shorter compared to length of night in southern hemisphere why because north pole is facing the sun and south pole is away from the sun let's understand what is circle of illumination circle of illumination is the line which divides the lit up part of the day and the darker portion of the earth right so the part which faces the sun is day the part which is away from the sun is night one common mistake is done by everyone while drawing this diagram for day and night they color the diagram with the axis with the tilt of axis which is completely wrong please take care of this this is the correct diagram of how to divide the portion of day and night you have to draw a vertical line that is circle of illumination and then you have to shade the part accordingly if you shade the part along with axis it goes wrong clear In the next video we will learn about the other concept related to rotation and revolution bye don't forget to subscribe put comments and also click on bell icon bye